hello guys welcome back to c fashion academy as you can see today i'll be teaching you guys just a simple something how to make this design you're seeing at the center this plating design please make sure you watch this to the end so that you'll cover all the words secret thank you and may god bless you make sure you click on the like button okay guys i'm going to be showing us how i actually created this design at the center as you can see on your screen i'm going to show you how i did first of all what you need to do is to make sure you do what you you do what take your material as you can see according to the design you are seeing at the center but one thing you must do is that you must make sure that the material you are using is wider and longer like it should be longer with like two or three times the length of the design which you want to do and it also should be what wider okay like by two times the size of the design you are seeing at the center okay take it and pleat are you seeing it i actually pleated this one are you seeing it and i ironed you also pleat this one and you iron you also do the same thing on this one and you iron till you make sure let's say the length of this design at the center is what 12 inches or 10 inches make sure you pleat this thing to like make sure it is more than the length and it is what more than the width so that's what i'm going to be doing now so you move over to the next step so guys as you can see what the next thing you're going to do is to do or take it to the machine use a stitch and hold on the what the two sides are you seeing it I've held this side and you also hold this side. Do it carefully. If not, your plating is going to scatter. Then after you finish, make sure you take it back to the ironing board and do what? Iron it out again. Do you understand? So what I'm actually doing now, I'm going to do what? Finish sewing out this particular part. Okay guys, as you can see, the plate is now ready. I finished plating it. The length is longer than the length of my what? Center design and also the width is wider than the what the width of the design as you can see i stitched on this part i stitched on just to hold the words the plating okay so next thing we are going to be doing now is to be on the um the front part of the word senator top i'm going to actually do a draft at my design the way it's going to be then i will do what cut it off so guys before we continue another thing i'm also going to advise you on is what that your pleated material Please make sure you turn the back, then use your what your interfacing, which is the word the hair stay, the light one that looks like material. Are you seeing it? Is it an iron it so as for it to hold down that word, the damp part very, very well, so that this thing will not scatter. So as you can see, before we continue, I want you to take your interfacing this time around. You can also use any type of interfacing that'll be okay for you. But now, as you can see, I'm making use of my what soft gum stay. Okay, take it and place on that particular point which you are going to do what create your what front design are you saying this is this is to enable the material relax and stabilize while ironing and while working on that particular front part as you can see so i'm going to iron it out okay guys as you can see after you have finished gumming it out next thing you need to do is to do what fold the material back and do what draw out the design that you want at the center but please i can tell you, you can draw out any design you want do you understand it doesn't matter so it doesn't matter whether you want to use exactly what i just used now you can make use of any shape if you like you can even draw an animal it doesn't really matter do you understand any design if you like you can draw an apple if you like you can make a love sign you know any design you can draw so draw it out so i'm going to do mine okay as you can see guys i finished drawing mine it is not that simple but i'm going to direct to you i use the design from here I did something like this, just a regular design. Are you saying so? I'm going to take my scissors and they cut it out. But... Okay, guys, as you can see, I've actually cut it off. So, next thing I'm going to, I'm going to expand it. I'm going to expand it. Okay, guys, but before I expand it, please, I want to do something, something that will help us in getting the finishing of our work. So, I'm going to notch small here. I'm going to open up here a little, depending on what I want to see. What I'm trying to tell you is that at the end of the day, we are going to fold out this particular one. Are you seeing it? You're going to fold it out and just to achieve a what? A neat finishing. So, we need to do what? Notch out little here. That's just something like quarter inch. okay it is okay so next thing we are going to do look at it i want to show you guys i'm going to be are you seeing it i'm going to be using my iron see look at the place that i notched are you seeing it so now it can help me to do what food are you seeing it so i'm going to be using my iron i'll iron like this see it here with the shape quarter inch are you seeing it look at it i'll be ironing like this please i'm just the one handling the camera on my hand that's why i cannot use my two hands I'm just doing this thing. This is just night, midnight work. Okay. Are you seeing it? So this is what you do on this side. Turn it over. Do the same thing on the other side. Then you can now do what? Expand. Okay. 
Okay, guys, as you can see, I've actually done that, but I've not done on the other side, as you can see, but I'm going to do the same thing on the other side. As you can see, the notch we actually um, affected here, we help here relax on its own. Okay, so that's the same thing I'm going to do on this particular side. Okay, as you guys can see, I've actually done that. So we are going to the next step. So calm down, relax. Please make sure you watch this video to the end, but it's very, very important to unveil all the secrets that I'm going to be using here. And make sure you click on that like button so as to appreciate or click on the thumbs up if you actually love what we are doing thank you may god bless you so let's continue okay guys next thing we are going to be doing now is to do as you can see, see our plating see the opening so all you need to do is what take your plating and do what place on top of it let it cover all the sides are you seeing it now take a pin and do what hold on the different edges what we are going to be doing now is what when you finish doing that as you see, can see the front part we are going to be top stitching on this side round do you understand that's what we're doing okay So guys, as you can see, I'm done with the, look at it, pinning it. So I'm going to be sewing on the what, edges. Do you understand? So after I finish, I'll be showing you the next step. I'm going to cut off the excess from the what, the back. Okay. Okay guys, as you can see, I'm done with the what, the stitching is so neat, looking so neat. Are you seeing it? So next thing you need to do is to what, turn the back. Now as you can see, I still have excess. I purposely did that excess, as you can see. So I'm going to be using my scissors. Look at it. I'm going to be using my scissors and I'll be cutting out the what, the excess. Remember, when I cut out, because I'm still going to use the excess and do something else. When I cut it out, it's not going to scatter because of the what, hair stay interfacing that I gummed at the back. Are you seeing it? So I'm going to be cutting out this particular one. Removing the SX. Okay, guys, as you can see, I'm done removing the word SS. So when you turn it again, you see the word, the real design at the center. So the, see here, let me tell you something. This thing I just did now is not just only on this side. You can use it on anywhere. Do you understand? You can use it and do what? Put a pocket. Do you understand? Inner pocket. Anything you want to do, you want to. This is how to do it. It's so easy. Okay, thank you very much. Okay, guys, as you can see, this is the final stage. As you can see, please, um, I apologize. I'm just the only one with the camera. So what, I usually, what I'm doing now is what I will show and I will show us. But hope we really get in this particular tutorial. Okay, look at it. I will see. Remember, the pleating was normal. But what I did was I started sewing from what at the middle part. Now, how, see how I did it. I fold here. Are you seeing it? It was flat before. If I pull it back, so I did what? pulled it in are you seeing i'm sewing on top of it so let me go to this side and show you that okay so look at it now so you see just what i did on this particular one i fold it like this and so are you seeing it that's the same thing i do on the other one look at it i fold this one and so fold this one and so are you seeing at the middle till i get to the end so that's actually how i got this particular one so guys this is actually how i did it so the next video the next um, image you're going to be seeing now is just the finished product do you understand so guys i thank you so much i love you so much please make sure you subscribe to my channel and make sure you like this video give it a thumbs up if you actually love it thank you and may god bless you okay guys see the final product you can see the product is nicely done now as you can see thank you may god bless you once again i love you guys i continue to do this particular video of a thing for you guys i'll be shooting videos for you guys yeah i'll be doing that so thank you and may god bless you the only way you can support me is to make sure you comment make sure you like this is the most important make sure you like show me that you like the video by clicking on that thumbs up and i will appreciate that thank you and may god bless you i love you guys but god loves you more